approximately at 4:20 pm the minute hand crosses the hour hand what is happening at 4:20 minute hand approximately it will be little more than 4:20 it will cross but 4:20 it is crossing the hour hand it crossed around 6:37 pm also but how many times they are crossing in 12 hours 11 times 11 times it crossing means almost after every 1 hour or every every 60 minutes they will make 0 degree correct or they will make 180 degree but here question is crossing to each other means making 0 means two time has given 4:20 pm and 6:37 pm during these two time how many times ideally they should cross two times because just will take the time difference it is more than 2 hours or approximately 2 hours then two times they will cross our purpose is to find the time between two consecutive crossing means not two times when they will cross next time after 4:20 pm and once we got that number or that data based on that we will compare with 65 into 5 by 11 minutes and we will able to find it is loss or it is gain or if it is a loss how much loss if it is a gain how much gain in a day just basic calculation just will try to do in a day 24 hours time duration of crossing this is 2 hours 18 minutes 138 minutes then p consecutive time crossing time it will be 138 by 2 69 minutes of course 69 is more than 65 into 5 by 11 what will happen clocks are going to slow they are losing the time they are losing the time how much they will lose just we will take difference nothing else no need to think in very high five way 69 is greater than this 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 it is slow it is losing time 69 minus this in one hour in one hour it will lose 39 by 11 in one day just to multiply 24 into 60 divide by 69 then you will get how much losing this much losing this much time will lose in one day by this clock if they are uh, crossing to each other consecutively after 69 minutes